What a mighty God we serve. We serve a living God. What a mighty God we serve. Hallelujah. Angels bow before him. Heaven at adore him. What a mighty God we serve. I say angels bow before him. Heaven at adore him. What a mighty God we say hallelujah we serve the mighty god the angels bow before him and heaven and earth adore him what a mighty god we serve what a glorious god we serve the lord is our king his i am that i am his king of kings his lord of lords May your name be exalted. In moments like this, we will lift your name high. In Jesus' name, amen. I'm Pastor Janet of Osia Pokuya Apa from Christ Ambassador Pentecostal Church, Italy, Bergamo. I'm here to share the word of God with you. We encourage ourselves and pray. Hallelujah. Turn your Bible in Job. Chapter 22, verse 28. Thou shalt also decree a thing, and it shall be established unto thee, and the light shall shine upon thy path. Hallelujah. My title for my message today, he said, decree, and it shall come to pass in your life. Hallelujah. In our Christian life, we need to live a life of holiness and righteousness. But in addition to that, it's also a life of authority and power. When God allows us to say things and to believe on things and to pray for things, and he bring it to pass in our life. Hallelujah. And those of the verses, one of it is what God who can bring things to pass in our life. Hallelujah. First, we can decree a thing. Hallelujah. And one of the ways God fulfill his promises in our life is through the word we decree out of our mouth. Hallelujah. When we take God's word into our heart and speak them out of our mouth, they have power and it becomes God's decree. Hallelujah. Isn't it amazing for God to give us the privilege to decree a word and he establish it in our life. Hallelujah. This moment, you are going to learn how to decree and declare a word in your life to establishment. Hallelujah. Maybe doctors have declared you, giving you a certain month, giving you some days that you are going to die. This is the time for you to decree out of your mouth and say the word of God say, I will not die, I will live to the fullness of God. Hallelujah. He said, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I fear no evil for thou art with me lord you say you will never leave me or neither forsake me this is the time doctors have searched for me this is a this disease doctors are saying this is what doctors say i cannot make it but i know you god that you are well say we will not die we will live and declare the goodness of 
God. Hallelujah. When you declare the word, God will intervene in your behalf and he establishes it. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. You know there is no money in your pocket. You have looked for job. You have hunt for job all the years. But this is the time God will establish your decree out of your mouth that he is your shepherd and you will not want. Hallelujah. He is a God of way maker. He make a way for the Israelites. When Pharaoh and his people are coming to kill him, he make a way in the Red Sea. He opened the Red Sea and the Israelites passed through and fed Pharaoh and his people were coming to attack them. The river swallowed them up. You said, God, you have done it before. So I know you can make a way where it seems to be no way. Any door that is shut in my life, you have the keys of David. Lord, open it for me in the name of Jesus. And God of way maker will create your path. Hallelujah. Remember, he said he will never leave us, neither forsake us. He's always ready that any word we decree out of our mouth, he's ready to establish it. What word did you decree and declare? Hallelujah. Oh, I'm broke. Oh, Oh, how can I make it? No. Say, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Hallelujah. And God will establish it. And he said, he will shine light on our path. Hallelujah. The Lord, the God will shine light on on our path, hallelujah. This will be the best of life to say to every darkness of sickness, every darkness of stagnation, every darkness of delay, every darkness of negativity that go out from my life, hallelujah, because the Lord of what? Sunlight upon your path, hallelujah. Declare this words upon your home. Declare it on your family. Declare it in your business. Declare it in your children. Declare it in your parents. And God will shine his light on your path. This is the living God that we have come unto him. Hallelujah. And the darkness in your life is removing it and bringing light onto your path. When we go to the beginning of creation, hallelujah, when he created the world, he said there is darkness cover the surface of it. And he spoke one word. He said, let there be light. And there was light. God has spoken a light in your life. And every darkness is removing. Every darkness is removing. Every shame is removing. Every hardship is removing. Every difficult is wiping away from your life and your family life in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you this hour. We bless your name because you are God. Father Lord, we have decree and declare a word in our life. Let it accomplish in the name of Jesus. Let your light shine on our path. Let your light open the way for us. Let your light see us through. Let your light bring healing and power into our bodies. In the mighty name of Jesus, we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Please, I will urge you to like, subscribe, and share the gospel to win life for Christ. Hallelujah. I'm Pastor Janet Ofosia Pukia Apa from Christ Ambassador Pentecostal Church, Italy, Bergamo. Shalom. Peace be unto you. Amen.